Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. On uh, this video we're checking out a laundromat. We're going international. We're going over to the UK and London to be exact. We're going to check out a highly rated laundromat here. See, uh, see how it matches up to the US versions that I've been checking out. Um, so, let's get started with this video. Alright, we're looking at Boswell Laundrette. Laundromat and dry cleaners. One of the largest dry cleaners and Launderers in Central London, over 15 years experience, express service, top quality. It's their website, Boswell Laundry. Looks like they have uh, delivery and pickup. Okay, looks like a small little place, which tends to be these uh, inner city laundromats. Seven days a week, eight to eight. I uh, can't tell what type of machines these are. Uh, we'll see once we go to their uh, Google page. Let's see, laundry. You know, I'm always a proponent. You always want to have a lot of pictures on the website. Um, we don't need stock photos. We need pictures of actually in the store. Uh, let's see if they have the prices online. I like to having prices online too, so people uh, know exactly what your prices are. I do get calls. Okay, here we go. Ladies dry cleaning, dry cleaning. Laundry. Wash and fold. Okay. Contact by a phone number or a here you go, phone number, email, and uh, request service. All right, let's check out some uh, pictures in the street view and uh, see what we're working with here. Okay, pictures from inside the store. Right off the bat, you see an out of order sign. Looks like we got JLA machines. Never heard of this brand. Uh, a lot of bags around with post it notes. Wonder if that's for the, the wash and fold or whatever else. Okay, this looks like that the outside of the store. Handwritten note here. I hate that. Looks like they only have about one row of machines here, one machine here, and a couple dryers here. Let's see some more pictures. And a bunch of handwritten signs. Small little storefront in the city. bags all right so in the city big wash and fold business I got their own trucks a small little place can't be more than uh, like 400 square feet Looks like the these are the dryers, single stacked or single dryers, Speed Queen. I mean, this looks normal. This must be the one machine. Looks like a the JLA model. Six dollars, six euros um, to start. Stock photo, stock photo. I don't know why there'd be benches right in front of the dryers. It's an odd place for them. The power of water. Electrolux. I 
Maybe those JLAs are the <clears throat> European uh, Electrolux models. Oh, coming soon to Boswell Laundry from last year. Okay. That was uh, one of the worst uh, tours that I've seen so far. The store is super small. Not a lot of pictures, even on the website. So let's see some of those reviews. Like I said, this is one of the better reviewed laundromats in London, so let's see uh, what people are saying. Where's Boswell Laundry? Boswell Laundry. There we go. 4.5 stars out of two over 200 reviews. see what uh what the people are saying sorry my computer's going kind of slow oh best laundry in London always great service great service <laughs> one star not worth it. They charge twenty five for wash and dry. Response from owner: Thank you. <laughs> that might be my favorite response I've ever seen. Best service ever. Staff is very friendly. They have three machines: one big, one medium, one small. Huh. Worst laundry maids ever seen. Prices are high. Staff is rude. Owner is rude. Quality is poor. That's pretty strange. You see a lot of one star and a lot of five star reviews. So, hmm. let's see if we can find something in the middle. Let's see what's going on here. Perfect service. Perfect service. Here's a four star review. We were very pleased as the owner honestly told us when we arrived a bit late, we wouldn't have, we, we might leave a wet laundry, came back the next day and had good experience. Oh, four star review. Oh, here's a three star review. Great for tourists who are on a long trip to Europe to do some laundry. Nine dollars for small washing drying. All right. Sorry, not $9, nine dollars, uh, nine euros for a small load of washing, drying, and soap, which take about one hour. Pretty simple. I could pop by the cafe next to it, have a quick bite while eating. Even the three star review is not bad. Just all right. Here's some more. Oh, two one star reviews in a row. The guy who works in there, the fat one, is the rudest, meanest man I've ever met in my life. If you don't believe me, I've read another review saying the same thing. I need the owner's number so I can reform. I give him zero stars if I could. It was four years ago. Oh wow, ten years ago. The place has been around a while. Five years ago, thieves. Changing their prices. So you got you got the good reviews, you got the bad reviews. Worst man in the world, rudest man without patience, always speaking rude to people. So I don't know if this is uh oh, here, that's the response from the owner. Uh, just basically a, a response from him, but small little shop. Seems like the majority of customers leave good reviews. So, you know, you don't need a $3 million laundromat to get good reviews and make money. You know, the the process is simple. You know, clean, good customer service, good equipment, and uh, you can make money. So, hope you guys appreciated the video, and uh, we'll see you next time.